Now, look, another news, Paul, significant news. Lawyers for Mirror Group newspapers have said Prince Harry is suing the press as a moral crusader, not because he has any actual evidence. However, you potentially, Paul, have your own legal battle brewing with Harry after he attacked <clears throat> you in the High Court with claims you say are untrue. So before we get you to yes. reveal what's going on, this is a reminder of the Duke's comments spoken by an actor. The phrase two-faced shit may have come from a voicemail. That's how I've always seen him. Hindsight is a very different thing. I can't remember whether I wanted a meeting or not. So, Paul, have you been in touch with Prince Harry's legal team since that? I certainly have, Dan, because although Harry has uh, a right to pursue his claim through British courts, along with several other people pursuing claims, um, uh, I, in support of his claim, he had to write a witness statement, and that is, is a legal document under oath um, which supports his case. Um, I just wish that he would get his witness statement correct, with correct um, words and advice in there, because um, personally, um, he said about me that I have sold his mother's possessions, which is completely untrue. So you can't bring um, a witness statement into court, which is untrue. I have written to Clinton's, his solicitors, three times now to ask them um, on what basis does he, does he make these claims? Because I would like to know whether or not um, Harry has evidence. I know he doesn't. But why, what gives him the right to make these claims in a court of law about me? That is defamatory and it's untrue. And I'm still waiting for a reply. And given you haven't got that reply, I believe that you are considering taking this to the Law Society? Yes. Well, my husband's a lawyer. So he says to me, well, you know, if we can't get a reply from Clintons, who are representing Harry, we will have to go further up the ladder and, and complain. Because we have a right to complain. I have a right to say this is untrue. And if this is untrue, what other parts of Harry's witness statements are untrue? Well, indeed. Indeed, that is, I think, the critical point in terms of his public reputation. But in terms of your reputation, Paul, mm. if you don't get some sort of retraction from Prince Harry, are you mm. prepared to pursue him legally? I am, I am prepared to pursue this further, yes, because it's my reputation at stake. It's not just Harry. Harry is a very privileged young man, and he's a petulant young man as well. But I have a right to defend myself too. Mm. So you could end up suing Prince Harry for defamation if he refuses to retract the false claim? Yes, it could go that far. Watch this space, Dan. Wow. Ball barrel. Keep us posted. Diana's rock, close personal friend. So great to have you, Paul. Speak soon. Good to see you, Dan.